Should I just start talking? One, two, three. If there was something like the custom culture when I was in high school, I would 100% have done it. I think it's such a cool thing that that Vans is doing with the high schools. I think schools should definitely um, focus up more on art. I don't feel like my school focused on it enough. I had a, a lot of fun in those classes because really that was for me where I could be me. It's the only class I could you know, get away with doodling all over shit. I think it's so important to do stuff like this because it really gives high school kids a taste of what they can do you know, in the real world. And I think it's important for the communities to see too because so many art programs are in danger of just just getting cut. I feel like they think that it's an easily discarded program or subject, it's art. Why? Because well what are they going to be doing? Painting or you know? If, if kids don't get exposed to art, how are we going to have new designers? I mean I think it's such an important part of what we do. Yeah it would be a shame to lose something like that. I don't know, it helps kids kind of find find their voice and I don't know. And that's actually what Vans was all about, is like people finding their voice. The history of Vans that's amazing is that they used to throw contests uh, every week where kids would actually design new graphics and bring them into the store. The checkerboard pattern came from seeing high school kids drawing on their shoes. If I was to judge the shoes... I like really bold things. I don't know, I'm kind of interested to see something that functions in a different way. I just want to see what they do. I don't know, just a fresh point of view. Each generation's so different, you know? All the stuff I've seen them do is way different than what I would have done. It's just refreshing. I think I'm looking for the same inspiration that I get, like when I go to like a museum or I go out into the world. It's like I'm just looking for something to like move me or, or inspire me in a way that I haven't seen before. And I think that's the cool thing about people being able to design shoes. Just from last year, seeing the ones that came in, they were all so different and it was really surprising that they were high school students. So it'd be tough to judge it. There's a huge team effort that uh, makes this project special. You know, as a team and as a group, they've made their plan and they've done their designs and their paintings and, you know, it's, it's the same kind of group versus individual balance that you find, you know, in the real world. The group of guys that I work with, it's always kind of a team thing. There's some competition within that, but in the end all, we sit down and look at each, each piece, each shoe, and decide, okay, what's working, what's not. So in the end of it, 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 it is a, a group. A group effort. I don't feel that this can be won by just one talented artist within a class and that it will be made up of multiple ideas coming together to create something special. Oh yeah, $50,000? This custom culture thing is uh, pretty insane, especially where we're at right now with the uh, economic situation. I think that Vans doing this is pretty awesome right now, so it's kind of like coming to the rescue. <laughs> this is an opportunity for kids to get outside of the world that they're in currently. Hopefully it gives them some confidence, you know, that they were that they were picked or that their that their voice matters. I don't know, I just feel like it also it's an investment in the future. I think being creative doesn't just relate it to art, but it can also go into any field like um, engineering or um, even in medicine. It's just like you have to be creative and that's uh, kind of like a, a virtue that I think that should be taught. Vans has always been about creativity and I always thought that that was a cool part of it. Just being in an art show in some teeny little college like an hour from my house was the most exciting thing, so I can't even imagine what these kids think when they come to this thing, this has to be like mind-blowing. You know, each person's take on it is unique and uh, you know, maybe it inspires me to do something else as well. <laughs>